welcome. We are doing another reading video on Let's Read. If you can tell from this glare, we're reading this book here. This is a SpongeBob pop-ups from the early 2000s. Let's take a look at the book and see if it's a good read or not. The SpongeBob book was written by Stephen Banks and illustrated by Heather Martinez. It was paper engineered by Jean Vazio. Is that how you say it? This was made in 2004 around the same time as the SpongeBob SquarePants movie. So let's take a look at it and see if it's interesting. You open up the book, you get nice pop-ups like this one. It is an old book and most of it seems to be a work in progress. So here we got SpongeBob. Good morning, Gary, said SpongeBob. Time to do my favorite thing at my favorite place. Make cry patties of the crusty crab. Ah! And we got a nice little feature we can do here. We can pull out this. And inside is Gary. Meow. SpongeBob's arms also move a little bit. That's kind of neat. Let's see what the next page has in store for us. SpongeBob invited his friends, Patrick and Squidward, to go jellyfishing after work. Patrick said, Yes! Squidward said no. So long, Patrick! There's Squidward yelling from the house. And there's, I think this guy's name, I forget, is Tom, yeah. This way to jellyfish fields. And as you can see here, over at Patrick's house, we pull up this little tab, and we can see that Patrick's in there. See you after the eight hour nap, SpongeBob! Double Krabby Patty Deluxe with the works coming right up, Squidward! Yelled SpongeBob. Look, Mr. Krabs! Twelve hands! I'm Lean Mean Fry Machine! So, yes, we got SpongeBob, and he's got a bunch of hands. And there seems to be a little slider here. I guess makes it look like he has more than one hand. Doesn't seem to do a whole lot, actually. In fact, it doesn't really feel like he should be really pulling it, but I guess it does work a little bit. Let's see the next page. We got Sandy in her tree dome. After work, SpongeBob stopped by the tree dome. Wow, Sandy, you're really getting good at that flying monkey kick. Thanks, partner. Yelled Sandy in midair. Next, I'll show you the cranky. Octopus flip! Then we go jellyfishing! Alright, it looks like we can make her do a flying octopus kick a little bit, but not really. I mean, it feels like you can bend it, but at the same time, not really. That's the only movable thing in this little area. Sorry about that nasty jellyfish sting, Patrick, said SpongeBob. I really thought we had him! That's okay, Patrick replied. Just lying still makes it feel better. In fact, I wouldn't move from this spot even the Flying Dutchman showed up. Don't be silly, Patrick. Ah! The, the Flying Dutchman would never come to Goo Lagoon. He can't get his hand. And there they are laying down, and there's Larry, and there's the Flying Dutchman scaring off even the surfer. Wild way! <laughs> and here is the jellyfishing. Barnacles, exclaimed SpongeBob at Jellyfish Fields. That's the biggest jellyfish I've ever seen! Do you think we can catch him? Patrick asked. Uh, fellas, said Sandy. I don't think those nets are big enough. There's only one way to find out! SpongeBob replied, raising his net. Charge! As you can see here, these guys fell over a little bit. Fortunately, whoever owned this book previously decided to rip it. But you can see we got some uh, big jellyfish stuff going on here. We got Fred there. It looks like a green Fred running away. And it doesn't look like there's any movable objects in this vicinity. So that's just the end of this page. Unfortunately, that just broke. In case you're wondering, that's the end of the book. There's even advertisements from some, for some other stuff. And that was the SpongeBob pop-up from 2004. I quite, quite liked it. It was pretty short, simple, and sweet. But if you like pop-ups, well, here you go. I don't know how this is available for sale still because it is, well, an older book in the SpongeBob canon. So it's probably now on Amazon, but... I'm going to find a thrift book link in the description below, like different food fight. Thank you for watching. I have other book reviews, so go check those out. And let me know if you want me, what book you want me to read. I got a lot in the background here to even read still, but and even more down. I got this giant bookshelf full of stuff like this. But if you like it, make sure you let me know. And I'll see you next time for a book I do then.